Do we remember because he was punished, or do we remember because we're supposed to overthrow the government? An excellent question. So for those who don't know, today is the 5th of November, that's Guy Fawkes Day, or Bonfire Night, here in the UK. It marks the anniversary of a failed attempt to blow up the Houses of Parliament with the King inside by a bunch of Catholics, including this guy, Guy Fawkes. When the plot is foiled, the King passes a law saying, hey, let's celebrate my lucky escape every year. So originally, we're celebrating the plotters getting caught, and to this day, we still burn Guy Fawkes every year in effigy on those bonfires. Because the plotters are Catholics, originally the festival's really popular with anti-Catholics, who are like, hey, remember, Catholics blow things up, they're terrorists. So whenever people are scared of Catholics, they start celebrating Guy Fawkes Day hard, to the point where by the 1640s, people who are anti-monarchy still celebrate Guy Fawkes Day because they really hate Catholics. Instead of burning effigies of Guy Fawkes, they'd burn effigies of the Pope. In fact, I would argue that's why Guy Fawkes Day has survived when lots of other similar celebrations haven't, because you can read it both ways. You can celebrate because someone tried to blow the king up, or you can celebrate because the king luckily escaped. Either way, we all agree we like burning stuff.